rivals collided for the 121st time as the Richmond Spiders hosted William & Mary. The Tribe would strike first and it'd be the decorated senior in his last game in a Tribe uniform. And off Grimes again. Attack side. There he goes. Jonathan Grimes gives William & Mary an early lead. The next William & Mary possession. Quarterback Brent Caprio taking a shot downfield off the flea flicker, but it's picked off by Reggie Barnett and Barnett returns it into William & Mary territory. Very next play, quarterback Aaron Corp looking for the end zone and connects with his wide receiver Ben Edwards for the touchdown and Richmond would go for two and take the eight to seven lead. Next tribe possession in the second quarter, Caprio rolls out, looks, and finds his receiver DJ Mangus in the deep corner of the end zone, and after a failed two-point conversion, the Tribe take a 13-8 lead. Richmond trying to answer, as Corp connects with Edwards again down the sideline for 29 yards to the Tribe 23-yard line. This would set up a 35-yard field goal for kicker Remington Henshaw to cut the Tribe lead to 13-11. Tribe on the move before the half, elect to go for it on fourth down deep in spider territory but the Richmond defense would hold and keep the score 13 to 11 at the half. William & Mary would put a drive late together in the third and it'd be capped off by a one yard quarterback sneak by Caprio for the touchdown. And after a missed extra point, the Tribe extend their lead to 19 to 11. The Spiders would answer right back in the fourth quarter as running back Kendall Gaskins gets the carry and scores from six yards out. And after an unsuccessful two point conversion, the Spiders trail 19 to 17. Richmond setting up for a field goal to take the lead. But it's blocked by the Tribe. But wait a minute, Coach Lindenberg says a Tribe defender tried to field the blocked kick and fumbled it back to the Spiders. And he was right, and Richmond would get a new set of downs. The Spiders would capitalize as Gaskins again, this time from two yards out, and the Spiders take a 23-19 lead. One last shot for the Tribe, third and 12, Caprio gets it to his receiver Trey McBride, and McBride would break a couple of tackles and somehow gets the crucial first down for William & Mary after a 20-yard pickup. Six seconds to go, fourth and goal for the Tribe at the Spider 2. Caprio fires, and it's caught by Sean Kearney for the touchdown, and the Tribe with three seconds remaining go up 25 to 23. Corp with one last heave to the end zone, hoping for a miracle, but it's batted away and William & Mary wins a thriller 25-23 over Richmond.